Hello, welcome on Channel 6. Today we are going to talk about death penalty. Nowadays, many countries uh, allow that sentence. For example, as it is uh, explained in an article taken from BBC News, last February, South Korea ruled that death penalty was legal and didn't violate the Constitution. However, Europe is the only area where death penalty is banned. No execution has occurred since 1997. The Council of Europe declares that on its website. Hello, Stéphanie Lachaise. Hello. You are a journalist specialized in reports about, about capital punishment. What do you think about that? Uh, well, uh, I don't understand why death penalty is abolished in Europe, but not everywhere. Uh, I think there's no evidence of some culpability. Uh, that's why uh, people are sometimes killed as the innocent. Uh, look, in this article, um, at the case of two women who have found proof to defend two men, um, and with their help, uh, these two persons have been released, and I quote, they had lost 18 years uh, of their lives. And on another one, I can quote, Hans Skinner saw his execution suspended by the US Supreme Court on March the 24th, less than one hour before the scheduled time of his execution by lethal injection. So the risk um, of executing an innocent is really important. Uh, according to me, it's like playing with someone's life. Thank you. So, according to you, uh, death penalty should be banned. Um, actually, with the case of Hank Skinner that you've just mentioned, uh, in Texas, we can see that death penalty is decreasing in that state and others in the United States. Hello, Soyel. You, are an you were an executioner. Is the decrease of capital punishment a threat to your job? Uh, yes, that's one of the reasons why I quit in my job. All right. And is it psychologically a hard job to do? Um, as you said, it was my job, and according to me, it was just a job. And Excuse uh, me, do you really think that it's a job? I don't believe it. Uh, yes, I was paid for that. I recognize it's not the best job in the world, but it was my job. And, uh, you know, I didn't consider myself as a killer, but more just as a loyal employee. Um, anyway, to answer your question, um, it was hard psychologically. Um, that's why I had to prepare myself two days before, uh, because uh, taking a life is not a pleasant thing to do. And uh, recently I read uh, an article uh, that, uh, about a study made by students uh, saying that death penalty saved life in a way. Uh, actually, the students had compared the number of executions with uh, the homicide rates and they concluded uh, that it saves life because the murder rates tend to fall as executions rise. And uh, when I read that, I think uh, that my job wasn't a so bad job because... Um, and then when I remembered uh, um, what I did, um, I, I think it was a bad job and it was really difficult to perform it. Thank you, Sierra Le Parc. Um, Stéphanie Lachaise, you said that you were completely against death penalty, but would you be able to um, be an executioner? No, I couldn't do that, be paid to kill or listen the last word. Uh, I have an article uh, taken from the New York Times, uh, which uh, is a list uh, of um, condemned person words and I can quote, uh, for example, I would like to say goodbye or death row is full of isolated hearts and suppressed minds. But I couldn't hear that. Okay, thank you. Sierra Le Parc, so that people can understand better, can you just explain us the methods of capital punishment? Um, you know, execution methods evolute. It's less violent and it's more fast uh, with the one drug in the injection instead of the free drug uh, cocktail, which was uh, sometimes painful, but um, I think it's kind of justice. No, uh, I think I could a life for a life uh, from the, the article of the New York Times, um, but it's the same. I think uh, it's a kind of vengeance for the victim, for the families, and I'm against that. There are other methods to punish, uh, to punish these persons. Yes, but it's it's a kind of justice. Okay, I think the debate is over. Uh, thank you very much for coming here to discuss about death penalty. 
See you tomorrow on Channel 6. We will be talking on the banner of the Burka. Thank you.